again, take those eyesores from uh to amazing with these 21 ingeniously easy ways to hide the ugly stuff in your home by Peggy Wang. 1. Camouflage an oddly placed light switch plate with a photo gallery. No one will even stop to ponder why there's an effing light switch in the middle of the wall. Using an array of frames and wood tones and white, create a little gallery wall to draw attention away from the awkwardly placed, aka bothersome, light switch plate. As for the art, you can just pick it up at a local thrift shop. Number two, hang a black drop cloth behind your desk to hide a tangled mass of wires. Use bucky ball magnets to affix the cloth, making this a supremely easy DIY. Number three, Turn a low drawer into a pet feeding hutch. Four, spray paint your folding chairs. Metal folding chairs, for whatever reason, usually come in that weird, ugly brown color. Make them fun and bright with a little spray paint. Number five, instead of your standard garment rack, opt for a ceiling rope hung rack instead. Store-bought garment racks tend to look cheap and messy, so just make one. Using an old curtain rod, just cut down to the size needed. Create a rope-wrapped hanging clothes bar that is suspended from the ceiling with very well-secured hooks. Use hot glue to help secure the rope to the curtain rod. Once the rod is completely wrapped in rope, anchor two hooks into the ceiling at about the same width as a rod. Finally, use rope to suspend the new clothes bar from the ceiling. Simply cut two pieces of rope at the same length, double them over, Create a knot at the ends, and then slip the clothes bar into them. Number six, turn those nettlesome basement poles into stately columns with molding. Just cover the poles with rustic pine boards and trim them out with moldings and paint them an accent color. It'll look totally striking in a mostly white room. Number seven, you can actually paint any ugly towel floors you're not crazy about. Does anyone actually like that mottled linoleum look? After cleaning it very well and use some crud clutter to tape it off, Put little pieces on the squares not to paint in. Use primer before using chalk paint for chalkboard black and gray and white color. Seal the whole thing with a couple coats of polyacrylic. Number eight, buy or sew your own crate cover for the pup. 9. Stash peekaboo plants in your cinder blocks. Your backyard will look like it's just bursting with greenery. 10. Use electrical tape to make over your washing machines. If you get sick of your stripes and polka dots, they're easily removable. Number 11. Install a rolling recycling bin in your kitchen counter or island. Twelve, update your garage door with a fresh coat of paint. Bonus points if it matches the shutters. Thirteen, easily update your boring built-in bathtub with Airstone. Things you need are two boxes of gray Airstone, two tubes of PL premium construction adhesive, caulk gun, a putty knife, and a hacksaw. Just apply the adhesive, then stick it to the tub, end to end, however you like. Make your cuts as you go. Apply molding trim after the last row. Number 14. Transition your backsplash into the wall seamlessly with a shelf bracket. 15. Keep your charging station in a kitchen or nightstand drawer just by drilling some holes. Many nightstands have open drawers in the back too, so you can keep your gadgets out of sight and out of mind. 16. If you have popcorn ceilings, you can actually scrape the popcorn off. It is a labor-intensive project, and make sure you get tested for asbestos before you begin. Many homes built before 1978 have ceilings that contain asbestos. Instructions. Prepping the room, cover everything from the top to the floor. Using a squirt bottle, water spray the popcorn until it is wet, and wait a couple minutes for it to soak in, and then wet it again. Use a razor and a flathead screwdriver to scrape the popcorn off. Dry overnight before sanding. Use the white tube ceiling texture. Clean up all the debris. Prime and paint your ceilings after you're done.
You can also cover them with plaster. Instructions. Cover furniture and floor with plastic cloths. Put your joint compound in a plastering tray or small bucket. Start in a corner of the room, starting at an edge of the ceiling least noticeable. Press enough compound in to cover the popcorn. Smooth it with a plaster knife. Let the ceiling dry for about a week before trying to paint it. 17. Turn your balcony into a yard with astroturf. Your mini backyard waits. 18. Use hooks underneath your desk to keep wires out of the way. Number 19. Upholster your unsightly box springs with fabric and a staple gun. Add furniture legs to get your bed off the floor. 20. Hide fluorescent lights in your home or office with these lattice covers. You could repurpose covers out of an old headboard or a cabinet door. Number 21. Give your kitchen appliances a stainless steel makeover with stainless steel contact paper. Yep, it exists. Here is how Julie Blanner revamped her dishwasher. Instructions. First, cut a piece of contact paper three inches longer than required. Then open your dishwasher door and start at the edge. Line the paper up with the top, peeling only an inch or so of the backing off at a time. Partner number one, start at the top, slowly working your way to the bottom using the credit card. Partner number two, hold onto the contact paper with a little tension to keep the paper from adhering. Then once you reach the other side, trim the excess off with a razor blade and remove any bubbles, working them out with a credit card. Last, for those ugly things you have no plan to pass on to your children and grandchildren, try this Brabantia Sort and Go Waste Bin. No endorsement, no commission transferred between product owner and me. I can assure you of that. Getting rid of waste isn't what it used to be. With Brabantia's easy to use sort and go waste bins, you can organize your waste your way. No mess, no fuss. They have a 10 year guarantee and are available in four colors and five sizes, six, 12, 16, and built in two times 12 or 16 liters. They're ideal for waste separation at home so you can recycle and be good to the environment. You can dispose of compostable waste right on your countertop and hide it in the kitchen drawer. Mount them against the wall or keep them on the floor for easy access, the ideal way to hide unsightly waste. Sort and Go built-in bins are compact and space-saving. You can mount them on the inside of your cupboard doors. Whether the door opens to the left or right, it fits. So they're out of sight and the bin comes out when you open the door for easy access, so you can get rid of waste quickly. With a sturdy handle and a convenient grip on the bottom, they're easy to empty out and clean. They're space-efficient and attractive. Leave the lid open while you prepare meals to dispose of larger waste items. They have a clever removable top rim to hide the bin liner and hold it in place. The self-supporting mounting frames are sturdy and easy to install, so they won't be taxing on your door hinges. The easy DIY mounting frame, fixings and instructions are enclosed. And there's the Perfect Fit Brabantia bags, perfectly matching your bin, so there's no pesky overwrap and it looks neat and tidy when the lid is closed. They come with handy tie tape for easy closing, removing and transport. They're available in an easy color coding system, so you can easily find your bin the right size liner. The size of the 6 liter bin is 25 by 20 centimeters and 18 centimeters in height. With the lid up, the bin is 43 centimeters in height. The 12 liter bin is 25 by 20 centimeters and 35 centimeters in height. With the lid up, the bin is 60 centimeters in height. The size of the 16 liter bin is 27 by 22 centimeters and 40 centimeters in height. With the lid up, the bin is 67 centimeters in height. The 2 times 12 liter bins have a compact design. The minimum built-in space is 43 by 53 by 34 centimeters. The 2 times 16 liter bins also have a compact design. The minimum built-in space is 43 by 55 by 36 centimeters. The Sort and Go product family comes in many colors and sizes, conveniently matching your way to separate waste. Done. See you again next week with tons of storage solutions that will expand your horizons to a new level. Meanwhile, like this video with your friends or share it with anyone you know. And last, subscribe to keep our channel in your watch list. And thanks for watching.